Hi, my sugar bears. It's me, Leo Brown, here once again for another edition of Car of the Day for November 17th, 2022. I hope all of you are having a great Thursday thus far. We are almost there. It's almost Friday. Yay. And can you believe that this month is going by so quick? I can't believe it. Anywho, I hope all of you are doing well. And I thank you guys so much for liking, for commenting, for subscribing and sharing. It really means a lot to me. So make sure to keep doing that. Make sure you like, make sure you comment, make sure you subscribe, become a sugar bear and make sure that you share if, you, if you're if you so inclined uh, my work. It really does mean a lot. Now, if you would like to get a reading outside of this modality, this medium, um, you can log on to my website, which is psychicleo.com. That's psychicleo.com. Dot com And you can also follow me on various social media platforms. All the information is in the description box below. So with that being said, let's get into today's card of the day for Thursday, November 17th, 2022. Today's card of the day is the King of Pentacles. We are dealing with royalty like a lot this week. Um, So now we've been dealing with queens. We dealt with the queen of swords. We dealt with the queen of cups. We dealt with um, the element of swords a lot this week. So now we're dealing with the element of earth. That's what the pinnacles represent. Pinnacles represent family, home, community, money. Um, um, let me think. Money, um, health, things like that. Things that ground us, things that 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 nurture us in a practical way. So the king represents someone who is very secure, someone who is very safe. He also represents the earth signs, which are Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo. Um, so you have a man here who's very content. He's very stable. With his money, as you can see, he got his money over here. He got his mind on his money and his money on his mind, honey. And he's very much about not only maintaining wealth, but securing wealth, securing the bag, as the kids would say. So the King of Pentacles this week is telling us, get in touch with the part of us that wants abundance. Get in touch with the part of us that wants to feel safe, secure, um, you know, wealthy, healthy, because um, it's not just about money in the physical sense. It's about, you know, planning, preparing, you know, things like that, because we're getting ready for, um, how do I say it? We're getting ready for the winter, and it makes sense that this is coming up, because we're getting ready for the winter time. and what do you do in the winter time? You go within. During the fall, winter months, during the fall, you let go of what doesn't serve you. During the winter, you plan for what is coming up for the new year. So this actually makes perfect sense that we're getting this card, especially during this time of year. So this is the King of Pentacles. It's all about, you know, like I said, preserving, um, um, planning, preparing, home, family, things that warm us up, things that give us warmth, things that nurture us, like I said, in a practical sense. So if this makes sense to you this week, then it's basically telling you, honey, prepare yourself, get ready, get ready for things to increase, get ready for your dreams to come true, your abundance, your money, you know, finances. But also as the increase happens, be mindful of it. You know what I mean? Like put a little money away, set some aside, save some for a rainy day. Don't just spend it, you know, crazily. You know, um, but then also take stock of your health. Make sure you're eating better, you're sleeping better, things of that nature. So that's what the King of Pentacles is all about. Health, wealth, and nurturing from a practical place. Let me know if this card resonates with you and resonates with a theme in your life. Leave it in the comments below. Until next time, my sugar bears, I'm Leo Brown. And I say to you, be learnable, be teachable, love yourself, and most of all, be you. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will talk with you very soon. Bye-bye.